Welcome to the Today for Kids Daily Calendar. Subscribe below so you don't miss out on any of our daily adventures. Ah, this is so relaxing. And there's so many pretty things. I see a cloud. Oh, and there's a bird. So pretty. Hi, Flippy. Oh, hi. Hi. What are you doing? Uh, I'm looking up at the sky. Oh, and what do you see? Some clouds and a bird. Oh, that's wonderful. Why are you looking up at the sky? Because it's... National Look Up at the Sky Day, of course. Oh, oh, it's also National Gardening Day. Gardening Day? Wonderful! We can start gardening? Yes, yes, Flippy. I thought we could plant some flowers. Oh, I would love to plant some flowers. It's also a moment of laughter day, so we need to laugh together. Can we laugh together? Oh. <laughs> of course, we laugh together every day. Can you laugh today? Or maybe read about gardening or start planting a garden? Or you can look up at the sky. There's lots to do today that's fun and simple. And it's a good day for lots to do. It is. Let's start by putting in our calendar. We need to start by putting in our shape for the day so that we know which day is today. Can you help us figure out what shape we drew yesterday? Yes, yes. That will tell us what square was yesterday. And that will help us to determine what today is. Oh, good, good, good. Do you see it? Did you say Easter egg? Should I show them? Should I show them? Yes, Flippy, you can show them. Look. Boing. Boing, boing. That's the Easter egg from yesterday. Oh, yes, yes, yes. And that tells us that yesterday was Tuesday, April 13th, 2021. And now that we know this was yesterday, we can move one square over, and that will tell us what today is. So we just move one square over, whoop, like that, to the right. And this will be the square for today, and it tells us that it's moment of laughter day, gardening day, and look up the sky day. And now we need to figure out what shape we need to put in for today. What do you think it will be? Oh, I hear some great guesses. Let's go back to the beginning and say the whole pattern together. Are you ready? Easter egg, pink circle, orange square. 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 Easter egg, pink circle. Did you guess pink circle? Let's put a pink circle in this square. If you want, you can practice on a piece of paper in the air with your magic finger. Are you ready? I like to draw. I need lots of practice because I'm still learning and I'm not really great yet, but it's so fun. Here, Flippy, I got you a pink marker. Oh, good, good. Let's get that way up. Oh, thanks. So I'm drawing the square today? Nope, you're drawing a pink circle. Oh, right, a circle. I go loopity, loopity, loopity. Ready? Start up at the top and go all the way around. And then I'll just color that in. Good job, Flippy. When we're just practicing, sometimes our circle doesn't really look like a circle. Or we might have some straight lines or some bumpy lines. Or we might color out of the line. And that's okay because we're all still practicing. Good job, Flippy. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Thank you for helping. So yesterday was Tuesday, April 13th, 2021, and we played Scrabble because it was Scrabble Day. Oh, yes, yes, we did. Oh, it was so good. Oh, good. And so we can check that off because we did that. And then we're going to go over here and we're going to set up the page for today. Can you do it, Flippy? Oh, yes. What do I need to put in first? Two words. Today is. Oh, yes, yes. And today has a capital T because it's the first word in our sentence, right? Yes, Flippy. T O D A Y. And then the word is I-S. Good job. So now that we know that this is the square for today, we can figure out what the name of the day is. Oh, yes. And do you remember how many days there are in the week? Yes. Do you remember? Do you remember? Let's count them up and say them together. Are you ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There are seven days in a week. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Oh, good job. Thank you for saying that with me. Now let's figure out what the name of the day is. This is our square, so we can just go straight up. I'm going to bounce. I'm going to jump. Can you help me? Dunk, dunk. Oh, that doesn't sound very good. Boing. Oh, good job. Okay. Wednesday. Today is Wednesday. Today is Wednesday all day long. Today is Wednesday. Today is Wednesday. Today is Wednesday all day long. Yay. So let's go see how we spell Wednesday. And Wednesday starts with a capital W or an uppercase W. It's the name of our day. So we always put a capital at any at the beginning of any name. And so Wednesday is with capital W and W sounds like wah, wah. Can you try it? Wah. Oh, good job, good job. Okay, so it's a capital W-E-D-N-E-S-D-A-Y. Wednesday, Wednesday, Wednesday. Oh, I'm bumping you. I'm sorry. Okay, so Wednesday has two syllables. Wednesday. Can you clap it with me? Ready, ready, ready? Wednesday. Oh, good job. Now let's put Wednesday into our agenda. Oh, good teamwork, Flippy. Good teamwork. Oh, thank you. Thank you for helping me, Flippy. Oh, you're
you're welcome. Let's put in Wednesday. Okay, let's see. Oh, whoops, I almost dropped it. Can you say the first two words in our sentence with us? Today is, and I run out of room here, so I'm going to go down and go back to the beginning here, and I'm going to put a capital W for Wednesday, because it's the name of our day. E D N E S D A Y, and then a comma. And that comma reminds us to pause before we say the next word. And the next word is going to be our month. Oh, good job, Flippy. Do you remember how many months there are in a year? Let's count them up and say their names together. Are you ready? Okay, so these are all the months of the year. Can we count them up? I'm going to jump. And you need to help me by saying all the numbers and all the names with me when I jump because it gives me lots of good energy. Are you ready? On your mark, get set, go. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Good job, thank you. Twelve months in the year. Did you guess twelve? Let's say all our names together. Are you ready? January, February, March and April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. Yay, good job. And do you remember which month we are in right now? Yep, the fourth one from the top. This one, April. Woof. Let's go spell April. And April begins with a capital A because it's the name of our month. And we always capitalize names. We always put a capital letter at the beginning. And A sounds like, well, hmm, it has two sounds. So it has a long sound, and that sounds like its name. So we say A, like as if we were going to say ape. Can you say ape? Good job. And then it has a short sound, and that sounds like Ah, can you try that? Ah, like as if we were going to say alligator. Can you say that? Alligator. Good job. So we have a capital A P R I L. April. April. And April has two syllables. Can you clap it with me? April. Oh, good job. April. Excellent. Now let's put April into the agenda. Okay, can we say the whole sentence together? Today is Wednesday, comma, and then I'm going to put in the month. Okay, so the month is April. Yes, Flippy. Capital A, P, R, I, L. Oh, good job, Flippy. And next, we're going to put in the number. Ooh, and what number do you think it is today? Whoopsie. Oh, I got it. I got it. Oh, thank you, Flippy. Oh, what number do you think it is today? I missed that. Oh, yes. Oh, good guessing. Let's count up all our numbers and see if we're correct. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's go. So yesterday was 13, and when we count, we say 13, but when we put it in the calendar, we say 13th. Can you try that? 13th. Oh, good job. So what do you think goes after 13? When we count, what comes after 13? 13, that is what the number will be today. Oh, I hear some wonderful guesses. Let's go up to the top and say all the numbers together and see if we're correct. Are you ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Did you guess 14? 14 is the number for today. Let's put it into a square on our calendar. You can practice on a piece of paper or in the air with your magic finger. You can think of 14 while we're drawing it on the board. Okay, are you ready? Let's go. Okay, Flippy, I've got the marker for you. Oh, thank you, Flippy. Let's try to get this open. Oh, they're so tricky. Oh, oh dear, oh dear. Oh, oh we got it. Oh, good job, Flippy. Okay, so... Let's put the first digit. Do you remember what the first digit is? Oh, yes, it's a one. A one and a four together make 14. Okay, okay. One, we'll pick a line. We'll start up here and go all the way down. Oh, good job, Flippy. And then a four goes down just halfway and across. Good job. And then we'll go back up to the top and we'll strike it down. A one and a four make 14. Good job, Flippy. Now let's count backwards. Oh, yay. 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, blast off! Oh, good teamwork. Okay, can you say the entire sentence that we have so far together? Really loud so we can hear you. Okay, today is Wednesday, comma, April 14, a 1 and a 4, and then a comma. And that comma reminds us to pause before we say the year. And the year is at the top of our calendar. Let's go check it out. 2021, or you can say 2021. Both of those ways are correct. So 
two, zero, two, one. Oh, good job, Flippy. And next, I'm going to practice the numbers all the way up to 14 because I need a lot of practice. My printing is kind of wobbly. So let's practice. Can you practice on your piece of paper? Oh, yeah. Practice on your piece of paper or in the air with your finger. Are you ready? Okay, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Oh, good job, Flippy. Whew. And next, I'm going to draw what I'm going to do today. And there's lots to do today. Oh, yes, there's so much. I'm still going to get a different color crayon. Oh, okay. I'm curious what you're going to draw today, Flippy. Boy, I'm having trouble finding the, my marker or my crayon that I want. Um, oh, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I see it. I see it. <laughs> okay, I got it. It's red. And I'm going to draw a flower. Ooh. Because it's gardening day. Oh, yes, yes. So we're going to get ready for our garden. And he's going to plant a flower there. Good job, Flippy. Next, can you practice your name down there? Oh, yes, I can. And I would like you to practice your name as well. Even if you don't know all the letters yet, just try on a piece of paper or in the air with your finger. Yes, yes, please. F L I P P Y. Oh, good job, Flippy. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Whew, that was a lot of work. I can't wait to do the rest of our things today. Oh, yes. And you know what, friends? If you don't know how to make all of these letters and numbers, that's okay. You can practice with us in the air on your paper. That is always good practice. But you can also just practice one letter a day. Check this out. Let's see. Flippy, can you help me? Oh, yes, yes, I'll help you. So this is the letter R. And we've been practicing the letter R this week. And we're going to get better and better and better making all of our letters. And you can too if you just practice making an R. Okay, let's see. You try it, Flippy. Start up at the top and go straight down. Just like that. Then make a loop out, bump, and then a line down from the bump. And this is an uppercase R. And this is a lowercase R. Can you try that one too? Okay, we'll start halfway up and strike it down. Then go almost all the way up to the top and make an arch out. Very good. Uppercase R and lowercase R. And if you practice your letters every day, pretty soon you'll know all the alphabet and you'll be able to make all those words that we use in the agenda. It's a very good idea. I hope you practice lots and lots and lots. How are you feeling today? Oh, there's lots of different ways that we can be feeling. Floppy, I got the feeling faces. Oh, good, good. Let's see. The first one is excited. Are you excited? Are you excited about moment of laughter day or gardening day or look up at the sky day? Oh, those are good things to be excited about. Okay, what about happy? Oh, look at this happy face. Let's see. Oh, are you happy today? I think I'm like happy because we are going to laugh. National Laughter Day means that we are going to chuckle and giggle and have lots of fun together. Maybe we'll tell some jokes or maybe we'll play some games. We'll just have some fun and laugh. Okay, so happy, that's a good one. Oh yeah, that is a really good one. I really enjoy being happy. What was the next one? Let's see. Oh, angry. Oh, Flippy, are you angry? Oh, no, 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 I'm not angry. Are you angry? Are you angry? It's okay if you're angry. Maybe somebody can give you a hug or help you with what's making you angry. Angry is okay. We just have to figure out what's making us angry and then try to fix it. Hmm, that's a good emotion. Let's see, what else do we have? Let's see, we've got sad. Oh my, sad, are you sad today? Are you sad, Flippy? Oh no, 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 not sad, not me. Oh good, I hope you're not sad today, but if you are, it's okay. We can talk to our adult or maybe spend some time by ourselves. What do you got there, Flippy? I have shy, nervous, maybe confused, like questions. Like sometimes I have questions like, what are all the clouds in the sky from? Oh, from moisture, Flippy. We, they from moisture and water up in the air, and then eventually they rain down. Oh, that's good. Okay, I'm not confused anymore, but I think I am happy. Are you happy? Yes, yes, Flippy. I think I'm happy. Are we both happy today? Yeah, let's pick happy. Okay. I got it. Oh, no, that's excited. No, that's not the one I want. Let's see. Oh, I can't find it. Oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. Okay, here it is. Oh, okay. Let's put it on the board here. Oh, good job. And what is your kind thing to do today, Flippy? Oh, oh, my kind thing. Think, 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 think. Oh, you know what? I'm going to plant some flowers and take them over to my neighbor and get him some flowers. Oh, Flippy, that's wonderful. Can I help you? Oh, that would be a kind thing to do to help me. Oh, that is a kind thing to do. Can you think of something kind to do today? Can you help somebody with something or share something with somebody? Oh, we hope you can find something great and wonderful and kind to do today. And we will see you again tomorrow. Bye-bye, friends. Click the like button and select subscribe so you don't miss out on our future videos.